I haven't had this much fun in a long time. We're here at Cayuga Lake. It's beautiful up here. The weather's a lot cooler than back home in Texas and the fish are biting. Clear water, deep grass, and probably the best northern largemouth fishery there is. Like, I mean, there's others that show out, but like pound for pound, when it comes to largemouth, nothing beats what this place is able to produce. And you're gonna see that today. Oh, this ain't no fun, is it? <laughs> Drop shots, kitchen largemouth? You betcha, let's go. The 10 foot flat out here, there's just one thin patch of uh, taller milfoil. And you know, last night I had you know 20 bites out of this. I only caught two of them. One was non-scorable and one was a four pounder. I know there's gonna be some small fish here. We may have to weed through, but hopefully it's not just an afternoon bite or something like that. Hopefully they're gonna be here. They're gonna be acting right. And you know, if it's anything like last night, I think it's possible to catch a dozen scorables here fairly quick. So we're gonna we're gonna get after it. We're gonna pitch a drop shot around. I'm mostly gonna throw a drop shot here just with the depth, the height of the grass. Um, as we get into some shorter grass and some deeper water, I'm gonna throw around the emo kamushi, little top secret Japanese stuff. But uh, for here, it's gonna be dominated by a drop shot, maybe a maybe stick worm. So we're gonna go lines in in 15 minutes. The crazy thing is, the boat ramp's right there. This is the shortest run I've ever made in my entire career. It's about half a mile. And so I was, I barely got on pad and I was here. I think I'm about to really bring the pain. That's a good one. It's a scoreable for sure. We're on the board, baby. I told you we were gonna whack them here, dude. Three five, three pounds, five ounces. All right. Baby, see ya. I'm pretty sure I saw that fish. I mean, dude, I couldn't pitch anywhere right through here yesterday and not get a bite. I'm gonna still be around here somewhere. I just can't fathom that I caught one that quick and they're not gonna be in all this stuff. That's a big one. Gosh, my drag's too tight. Not giant, but man. I mean, he's big compared to them one fives I've just been catching. Two pounds, 14 ounces. Feels like a scoreable. It's hard to tell. Feels like a good one. Not by much, but he'll, I'll take him. Overall, these are ugly fish compared to the deeper ones. Like that, fi a fish with a mouth like that out in that 17 foot of water weighs close to a pound heavier, believe it or not. I have had it this week though, where it's like perch, 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 and then a four pounder will pick it up. This honestly is fighting. This might be a small mouth. Two pounds, 11 ounces. Yeah, I mean, I'm just kind of milling around, honestly. I mean, you're not, as long as you're good with me, I'm good with you, whatever you want to do. And I know they're bass, because they, they may not dart to it, but they all kind of swim in that general direction. You know what I mean? That one got it. Not by much, but he'll score. Yeah, top lip dead center. Yes, sir. Bro uh, no, I thought I broke my lip, I didn't. Yeah, that's a good one. There we go. That's a good one. Same exact spot. I can't even get pliers in there. Three pounds, five ounces. Let me weigh him again. He's got my worm in his mouth. Hang on. Three pounds, four ounces. Three, four. There you go. See, look, ethics, right? So when I lose, when I when I when I miss the cut by an ounce, you know why? How about three in a row? He's just barely a two pounder, but we'll take him. Two pounds, three ounces. I think I'm gonna catch one on this cast. Though. I think we kind of slid over. 
don't think I was making as good of a cast there. That's a big one, I think. No. I mean, yeah. No, he's not a four pounder, he's skinny. Three pounds, 10 ounces. Feels big. I'm good. <laughs> Two pounds, 13 ounces. I got like three of them around me right now. They look good too. Well, this ain't no fun, is it? <laughs> three pounds, one ounce. <sighs> Gosh, you're just along for the ride. Three pounds, five ounces. They're all that size out here, huh? Two pounds, 12 ounces. I mean, I'll maybe move 20 foot in the last 30 minutes. It's another three pounder. Three pounds, three ounces. Hey, remind me in the period break to put sunscreen on. I'm putting it on. Might be a scoreable. Pretty sure it is. He's side swapping. Yeah, yeah, he is. Three and a half. Three pounds, ten ounces. Three ten. It's a dang good one. See, that's how they're supposed to be built, right there. It's been a fun morning so far, Alton. Uh, my main question for you, I'm watching this flat, you're scoping around out there. I know there's scattered grass. Now, are you trying to throw at grass clumps or at fish or at both? With that live scope plus, I am seeing plenty of fish and I've caught multiple fish today flipping at them. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. See yeah. ya. Sorry about that. No, you're good. <laughs> Three pounds, two ounces. I'm gonna start doing circles eventually. I don't know when. <laughs> Keep on forcing the issue. Wait till Randy called. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. That's the biggest one yet. I think that's a four pounder. He's close. I almost dropped him, but I didn't. He's close to four. Three pounds, 15 ounces. Three, 15. There we go. Hey, it may be kind of lame that I'm catching one on a fairy wand, but it's still fun. I don't know what to say. I'm supposed to be talking because I'm on camera and all that, but like when we've caught this many already today, I'm just kind of speechless. I've got some places we're going to catch some big ones later today. It's just you can't leave when this is happening, you know? 310. That's a beautiful fish. Look at how they're built up here. It's 105 in my house this week, so I'll take some 80 degrees and chunky three pound more than large mouth. The only problem, like when you've got other boats out here, like I feel like I was on the best spot and I'm kind of sliding up a little bit and you might lose it, you know. Pike. Maybe there will be, a, it was as good as it's fishing, maybe there will be a seven pounder caught this week. No. I'm, about, I'm about to head out. I think. One pound, whoop, one pound, 15 ounces. All right, let's try them again. One pound, 15 ounces. All right, close, but no go. I'll see you guys Monday. <laughs> yeah. Um, Todd Faircloth and Jeremy Lawyer. And what about Brett Height? Sorry. Little. I mean, it was a good period. It was a lot slower than my first one. Um, I need to explore some of the other stuff I found. Of all things, I need a heavy hitter's fish. That's kind of what we're thinking about now. Throwing EWG, you won't be disappointed. 
pliers are getting rusty. I need to get me a new pair. Two pounds, eight ounces. Two eight. Not a bad one. Good one too. Oh dude, there's another big one with it. There's another four pluser with it. There's a bigger one. Or as big. Gosh, look at how they're built up here, dude. Just straight up tubs. The bad thing is, is I want to move. <laughs> Hour 20. That's a big one. Well, he's mad. You pulled up here. Four pounds, 13 ounces. Four thirteen. That's the biggest one of the day. That's a dang good one right there. A little bit of water on the lens, but you get the picture.